Okay, what we're going to do, we, we always try to show a little bit of day-to-day -day activity here. We have to separate the Manxian vipers. They live together on a year-round basis for breeding, but we have to separate them to feed them. So the male is deep in shed. The female shed her skin last night. So Christine is going to move the male that's in shed very carefully and try not to bump him or rub him up or make him upset or anything like that and move him to another cage so that we can feed the female. So go ahead, Christine. Why don't you? We always try not to push their buttons. We don't want them upset. We don't want them scared. We want them very calm and basically to not be afraid of us. Careful. There we go. Just bring him, bring his head out here. Let me help you with the hook here. Get, put your hand on green. There we go. Okay, go ahead and take him to the other room. All right. Notice how we let him crawl in the cage. We don't mess with his tail or anything. She's not holding his tail when she walks with him. She's, her tail is just sitting in her hand. To that main shed viper, Christine is uh, nothing more than a tree, or she's just another silly human that poses no threat to him of any kind whatsoever. And he honestly, usually, has no defensive behavior. None of the main sense do towards people because of the way that they have been raised. And that is gently to the point where they do not believe that people are in fact dangerous. Would be bad if you're a wild one, but for these it's okay. Thank you very much.